Hello, this is Erica from Not Baus, and welcome to my revisit of Vessi shoes after six months of use. So this, of course, like anything else, will be an honest re-review. If you want to see the original view, links will be in the description, and I'm going to try to pin a link in the comment as well, so you can actually see the original review. So this is after six months. So let's get started. <music> So after six months, my experience is, well, let's start with the basics. Is it waterproof? Well, we're going to find out in this video. How did it hold up in terms of looks and feel and everything? Well, decently. I went through mud and everything else. Water, why not? These are waterproof shoes, right? So I'm still wondering about if it's still waterproof. And well, my video was uploaded originally about uh, seven months ago. However, there's about a month span I didn't wear them. But then all winter, I pretty much wore these. And in terms of temperature, below zero is a bit cold, but if you're just going in and out of your car, just walking to the coffee shop and whatnot, well, they're doable. Regular running shoes are very thin, might be a bit cold. So the tread itself held up fairly well on the hard surface, which is what I expected compared to my Adidas shoes that of course were my comparison because these shoes, Adidas shoes right here, are almost identical in price and it has a soft rubber on it, but it's all soft rubber. So these treads were pretty darn good. And these ones are not waterproof. They're super thin, super well lightweight, just like the Vessi shoes. Now, in terms of comfort over time, after about 40 or so hours, this did not hold up as well on a hard surface because I actually used this working security because one of my jobs was working as a security guard, going inside, outside on hard floor, concrete pavement, but it did keep my feet dry. And that's of course the main reason to get these runners. Leather versus the Vessi shoes. Yeah, the Vessi shoes are more comfortable for keeping your feet not feeling overly sweaty. And of course, these shoes held up in terms of comfort much, much better. In fact, even though the treads are worn on this, and I wore this longer than the Vessi shoes, actually an entire year, and these are actually more comfortable than the Vessi over time, so there's that. So I could replace the insoles in here, and replace the insoles could make it comfortable again, more like these. So, of course, both even price, but these are not waterproof. And that's where it gives this more value. I live along the West Coast, or the Wet Coast, just like the Linus Media Group. And the Linus Media Group, uh, which is a, you know, LTT and whatnot, and tech news, and they're the biggest tech channel on YouTube. Well, they may wear these, because they're along the West Coast too, and it's very, very wet and rainy all the time. So a shoe like this is not the most convenient. It's hot outside. A little bit cooler shoe is nicer. Now the waterproof test. Are these still waterproof? Well, time to find out. And I got a pull of water ready for me to find out because I don't know myself if these are still waterproof. So right here, I have one of my Vessi shoes I'm gonna wear on this foot because that's the one that's gonna see on the camera. Well, my shoe's gonna go off to the side once it's wet because I don't wanna wet anything. So we can see there's no watermark for my sock right now. So let's get this shoe on. So the nice part, of course, is these are slip-on, which makes it easier, but of course, sometimes it could be a little bit uncomfortable around the top of the shoe. That's where, of course, the tongue of the shoe can actually be useful. And right now, I'm just getting that top lip of the shoe loose. So now, to put my foot in the water and find out if my sock gets wet, which I'm hoping it won't. But of course, I never tested for waterproofing still, if it's still good. Okay, so right now, the foot's in the water. Let's move this tray back so you can see it a little bit better. Okay. Uh, my foot and my foot of my um. Yeah, so anyways, foot's been there for about 10 seconds or so with the shoe on. And is my shoe still waterproof? Well, let's find out. And oh, that was water that was already there. This little droplet there. But yeah, I'm happy to say this shoe lasted the test of time for waterproofing. Six months, still waterproof. So thank you, and I was actually scared my foot was gonna get wet, to be honest. So other than Vessi, are there other waterproof shoe options? Well, yes, there is. Columbia. So Columbia out dry shoes. The main feature of that is they're more of a hiking shoe. So if you actually want to go on rugged terrain, it'd be a lot more convenient than a Vessi shoe, which is more of a walking shoe. 
And another shoe is vtech.tw for Taiwan slash en if you're doing English. Indiegogo for a campaign and they seem to have a little more style in terms of shoes uh, if you want something fancier. Very similar to Vessi, however I cannot compare quality since I do not have those ones. You might also wonder about these other shoes called Tropicville. They're not waterproof but you can use them in the water, dry land, they won't stink from getting all wet. And of course that's something I'll be doing a review of in a few months time. I'm actually getting the new shoes that are not out yet. So I'll have to wait a couple of months but we'll see those ones when they come out. Thank you for watching and have yourselves a most wonderful day. This is not BIOS Tech and Hardware. And you might wonder what's so great about the Tropic Fill Shoe? Well, for one, it actually has draining holes so water doesn't stay in the shoe should your wet, shoe get wet inside of it. And of course, the Vessi shoes have kind of a foam, so I wouldn't see that as a great idea to get water in the shoe. So the Tropic Fill is actually meant to go from water to dry land and the water just drains out of the shoe. So this is something very interesting to me because I go kayaking and well, I do like to take hikes. And so we're gonna see.